Yeah, uh, and you did mention this actually on the show briefly before you mentioned her name. Caitlyn Jenner is such big news in the media. Mm -hmm. What do you think about the impact that she is having on the transgender community and the discussions that it's just opening up in general? Well, I don't know. I'm more surprised that um, Caitlyn came out as a Republican. And, uh, <laughs> you know, when, when I heard that, I'm like, hey, Caitlyn, welcome to my world. It's not going to be easy being a conservative female. So... Welcome to my world, Caitlin. I love that. That's so awesome. What do you make of, of all the Kardashian stuff? Do you think it's crazy how much they are in the news? And, you know, you've got kids. You see how the young girls mm -hmm. are kind of perceived in the media. and I mean, yeah. how they put themselves out there yeah. in the media. Uh, you know, I watch the, the, this, this pop culture phenomenon that, that is the Kardashians. So the, the way that I see the whole thing is um, how does anybody have that much time on their hands where they get to sit around and just chat and gossip and, you know, these are busy gals, right? And, you know, they're making billions of dollars. They're, and, and yet, anytime I've caught a glimpse of their show, it's like everybody just sits around. <laughs> what a luxury. I would love to get to just sit around 10 minutes, much mm -hmm. less the days and days on end. Speaking of, of families in the media, the Duggars were such a sweet Christian family and now in children, all of this <sighs> awful stuff, yeah. in infidelity and... Yeah. Oh, the molestation. Bad, bad, bad. But um, keep in mind that's one out of the 19 kids and counting. Um, it, it's one. I, I don't like to see the media try to um, uh, crucify an entire family, bring them all down, mm -hmm. when uh, it's one character within that family who is really, really screwed up. I feel sorry for the guy's wife. You know, she she's an innocent victim. The sisters, when they were younger, for them, to have been victims and now kind of being re-victimized because they're asked to talk about it and comment on it and they no doubt had thought that the issue was taken care of mm -hmm. you know 12 years ago when it happened um but uh i tell you that is such a lesson for all of us to um uh, to walk the walk man not just be talking the talk if we're going to preach it you know if we're going to say you know follow the good book and let's follow mm -hmm. the rules and all that and, and not exercise that within ourselves, well, that is the height of hypocrisy. It bites us in the butt, mm -hmm. as Mr. Duggar has found out.